marriage and the culture of the Luo. Aie. Aie is the first of two stages of a traditional marriage ceremony of the Luo tribe. Aie is a Luo word which means I agree. When a man gives out Aie, he registers his satisfaction with the wife. It is paid to stamp a relation. The presence of both parents on that day is a must. Not everybody is allowed to attend the ceremony. Only stepmothers of the bride as well as her uncles and their wives are allowed to attend. The relatives from the mother's side are not allowed to attend the Aie ceremony. Aie paves way for Nyombo. Yes, I am a polo, no pity, me to my man. Yes, I am a polo, no pity, me to my mama. Nyombo is the payment of dowry, which is usually in form of cows most of the time. It is the it is in order to thank the parents of your spouse for giving birth to and bringing her up. The groom comes along with his family, uncles and aunts who are the main participants of the dowry negotiation. However, the groom's family are not supposed to stay at the bride's house till 6 p.m. since it may end up bringing conflict between the two families. The bride's mother should prepare chicken and other meals are also included. Example is the cow's meat, whereby the cow should be slaughtered on that day. The people who are preparing food are the ones who are involved with serving the groom's family. After the Nyombo ceremony, one is considered married and the groom picks her from her father's house the next morning. <laughs> Today, after the two ceremonies are conducted, that is the Aie and Nyombo ceremony, it paves way for the preparation of the church wedding. No matter how modern you are, you will find that when you declare you have found a spouse, you will always return to tradition. <laughs>